Hi everybody and welcome back to Total OS Today. Uh, before I continue, I just wanted to wish, uh, or I hoped everybody had a very happy uh, Thanksgiving for those of you who celebrate the holiday here and abroad. And a very, very special thank you to all the men and women serving in military service here and abroad. You guys and ladies are the best. Okay, well this month has not been a very good month uh, for me. Uh, some of you may know that when I went on vacation here at the beginning of the month, I found out that one of my best friends had uh, passed away uh, before I had a chance to really see him. Um, just about uh, 10 days ago, I found out that my last surviving grandparent, my grandmother, had passed away overseas. I uh, did not get a chance to uh, see her. So, um, Grandma, if you're out there in the spirit world uh, listening and watching, um, I love you. Um, and another thing, I have a condition on my back, my lower spine called fa uh, not phase level two. This level two, I, I almost said disintegration. Level two degeneration. Something on my lower spine. Apparently, I had an injury that I never knew I had. It's possibly due to a fall or falls I had last year on the ice about uh, ten days ago or so. I had trouble walking pain down my lower spine and the best analogy I can give you is that it was a combination of a Windows virus and a Linux bug all wrapped in a nice little package in my lower back around my spine anyway I went to my chiropractor my doctor he says yeah this is what you have it's pretty common it was probably due to you know exercising an injury or something it's treatable and in some cases it might be reversible so if any of you out there are doctors or uh, chiropractors, uh, any advice or uh, added suggestions would be appreciated. I will be in therapy uh, for the next uh, at least two months and probably a healing process of about a year. Uh, so far it is not debilitating me. I'm not crippled, but uh, it sucks. And uh, quite frankly, this whole month uh, sucks in general. But that being said, I am thankful for the things that I have, such as my family and, of course, the wonderful community out there. Okay, let's move on. Um, the next video I will be working on it will be a Linux Mint 12 uh, comparison or versus Windows 7. I've done these in the past, and I'm not sure how to proceed uh, with the next one. Now, Linux Mint 12, the final version, uh, Lisa was just released uh, Saturday, November 26th. I have it downloaded and I've been playing with the release candidate you know a few minutes a day here and there and it seems okay. I, I was able to get it running uh, a stable run uh, in a virtual machine inside Linux Mint 11 uh, without any kind of crashes and uh, I mean it, it seems okay but as far as doing the comparison with Windows 7 I don't know how to proceed yet I'm either going to do it by myself you know comparing this Linux Mint 2 of course Windows 7 either do it by myself or possibly do a joint uh, comparison joint meaning between myself and my podcast partner Infinitely Galactic uh, we had once mentioned before about possibly doing a joint review podcast of a Linux release and that is certainly a possibility it's something I have never done before uh, I mean I've done reviews or comparisons by myself but never with a partner and that might be the best way to go if you guys think that's cool uh, let me know or let my podcast partner infinitely infinitely galactic uh, know also uh, shoot him a comment or a message and uh, if you think that might be fun to do uh, I'm certainly up for doing that as far as when you know I'm probably gonna be taking taking it easy here the next uh, at least the next month or two and hopefully the therapy sessions that I go to uh, will work uh, man this you know not being able to do uh, the exercises that I like to do and stuff like that really really totally well anyway those are the updates I wanted to pass along uh, that's uh, the Linux Mint 12 versus uh, Windows 7 that's what I will be working on 
next. Let me know how you guys think I should proceed. I did post a review or two of Linux Mint 12 RC Candidate. I had problems in the first one trying to get it to run in the virtual machine. I, I guess I was in fallback mode. I didn't know at the time. But I got it working successfully in a virtual box in Linux Mint 11. Now whether I will uh, look at it that way or just do a full install, I don't know yet. But let me know if you guys would prefer just you know, doing a single review of it. Uh, comparison or maybe a joint review between between myself and uh, infinitely galactic uh, I'm open for that no problem it's just a matter of uh, squeezing it into our schedules and see how how my therapy sessions go well I think that's it that's all I needed to say at this point uh, thank you for all your kind comments and suggestions I received a couple of nice emails I will mention that uh, sometime in the future as I like to say as always, thank you so much, and if I don't uh, talk to you guys before Christmas, of course, Merry Christmas if you celebrate it, and I wish you the best really throughout the whole entire year. Thank you guys, and uh, stay healthy, okay? Bye.